Hey everyone and welcome to my let's play of Sonic Generations for the PS3, 360 and PC. This isn't a blind run by the way, I did a playthrough beforehand. It was originally going to be blind but then I thought, nah, this is fail. Anyway, a couple of things that you'll notice. Firstly, Oma Chow has been switched off. Um, I just didn't want her on. Secondly, um, I've cut down all the load times so that you just know that they're there. Because, you know, having to wait... Uh, Lord knows how long for every single load time. Um, it does take up quite a bit of the video actually. I cut out the load times and it removed a good like one and a half minutes from this this almost 14 minute video. So yes, yeah, quite a difference. Anyway, Green Hill, Classic Sonic, spinning by at supersonic speeds, nostalgia flowing through the veins, bouncing off. Buzz Bombers. Spin dashing and running through loops and doing all kinds of cool stuff that you could do in the classics even though the class the physics aren't exactly like the classics but they're still extremely fun which is something that people just need to get into their minds sometimes. You know, it doesn't have to be exactly like the old games as long as it's satisfying and fun to play. Yes, there are some automation times, but this is getting into a discussion that I shouldn't be getting into because this is a let's play and it should be light-hearted and fun and funny. That's how I roll. Sonic. Hello, <laughs> classic. He's just like, yeah, whatever. Da 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 da. Meanwhile, somewhere in Nevada. Actually, it's 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 not Nevada. I I lie, I lie. It's it's not Nevada. Hey guys, what's going on? You having a party or something? Wait for it. <gasps> you voice actors, woo! Let the voice wars begin. I'm joking, I'm joking. But yeah, new voice actors. Um, they sound pretty good. I like. I much prefer them to the old ones. Actually, all of them. All. Of them, totally even the better ones. No Good old Roger Craig Smith. Yeah, right. I think he does an excellent Sonic. Like Chili dogs. Yep, there's loads of references in these cutscenes. Um, for the crazed, rabid Sonic fans like myself, you'll um, spot all these little details and stuff. No, the chili dog is gone forever. What is it, Tails? It is a puppy. It it's a big puppy that wants to give you a hug. See? See, look. Give the, pu give the puppy a hug. Give the puppy a hug. He just want to play. Why so serious? I, dis I, I, I disagree, Sonic. He's perfectly cool. I mean, don't you know how the people, they just hate Sonic's annoying friends? What people complain about constantly. The retro fans and the critics. Sonic's annoying friends ruin forever! And modern Sonic just got bitch slapped to purgatory. Wake up! This is no time for a nap. At least find a bed or a motel. And I'm fairly sure that that's not a motel. It looks more like a... I don't know. What could, what, what could you describe that as? Anyway, onto the actual gameplay now. Uh, this is the hub. Well, this is the first instance of the hub. Currently you're boxed in because, well, the only place to go is here. And we will be entering the very first modern stage. Green Hill Zone again! This time we're blazing through it as modern Sonic. And I have a bit of a cold, so sorry if I sound like I, my nose is blocked because it genuinely is. Uh, not nice. Uh, this was a pretty decent run. I played the heck out of this in the demo. It was so fun. Modern Sonic feels really good in this. Better than it does in both colors and unleashed. He just controls better than those games. Um, 
And he has the spin dash drift, which is the, the, the best. It's just the coolest drift ever. The other two drifts, just, they're just no contest. Colors' drift was tighter than Unleashed, but the spin dash drift just takes the cake. I still find myself not using it properly though. Oh yeah, and um, I'm one of those I'm one of those kinds of people that um, you know, any most a lot of the control faults the game may have, I'll just blame myself for it. You know, I'm just kind of like that. Like if 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 something goes wrong. I'll blame myself rather than con the controls. I'll say, oh, I wasn't fast enough, or, oh, um, you know, I didn't react quite quickly enough, or, oh, I, um, my finger slipped, or some crap like that. Anyway, boosting really fast, running really fast in this, in this green place. I love how every stage looks. Every stage is really beautiful, in my opinion. They all just look really, really nice. I mean, if you actually... You don't even need to stop, as long as you're actually observant of all the backgrounds. And just how much they've put. Just how many objects and... If you just look like there, waterfall, you wouldn't really notice that if you didn't properly look at it. I mean... You know, there's a lot of stuff to appreciate, and I don't think people properly appreciate it. And of course, we get our S rank. That's one of the problems with this game. S ranks are really easy to get comparative to Unleashed and Colors. That said though, there's still a fair few instances where I don't get an S rank. But now we have restored Tails. <laughs> what a derp face. That's just such a stupid pose to get frozen Thanks, in. Thanks Sonic. I thought I was dead. Floating without a body in a black limbo. <sighs> I'm gonna have nightmares for weeks. Yeah, well, you're Sakura, shut up. Hmm. Is it me? Or is that place we were just in awfully familiar? Mm, not Maybe. To me. This place looks like something. Yeah, nice reference. <laughs> Since Tails came in Sonic 2, he wouldn't know Green Hill, because Green Hill was in Sonic 1. Hence why it was familiar to Sonic, but not Tails. For those who didn't get the reference. Just so you know. It was a pie! Get me the pie! That might be a good place to check out. I'll be back soon. Wait, no! Give me back my fucking penny! Wait. Wow, you weren't kidding when you said Wait, what? I thought you already left. Okay, did you really just mistake your best friend for his younger son? Wow. How do you, how do you make that mistake? They look nothing. They don't even look alike. Classic and modern Sonic. Ugh. Anyway, that is Green Hill completely restored. Look at it. It's green and brown and red and yellow. And now we are able to switch between the two Sonics at the press of a button, triangle or whatever the top button is on the Xbox six, uh, 360 controller. But before we go and tackle the next level. Let us visit the skill shop. This is where you can buy a load of skills that allows you to customize um, customize Sonic, basically. Improve his abilities. First one we're getting is Blast Off. This one basically allows you to boost um, if you press square right as it says go. Then we got Speed Up, which speeds you up. Athleticism, which allows you to go faster underwater and uphill. Sure Footed, which makes you land on your feet as soon as you get hit. And those are the main ones, those are the main ones that we need. Now to equip them suckers! To them suckers! Power. We also have Power Break, is the one that you get by default. Power Break allows you to stop instantly. It is pretty useful. It helps, um, it helps to control yourself better. Um, you know, these skills, they contribute a number of things. They help contribute um, making Sonic faster. Um, giving him all around better control, um, helping him deal with different situations better, that kind of jazz. But now, we should move on to the stage. And guess what? If you guess by the looks of it, and you guess correctly, you would have guessed. I don't know. I'm joking. 
You would have guessed chemical plant zone. Yes, indeed. I'm starting with the model level first, because, um... Well, you'll see later. But... This level is another quite, um, speed-oriented one. And it's really thrilling to go through, in my opinion. Um, it doesn't qu require quite as much thought and careful uh, platforming as some of the Oh, God, frame skips. Uh, yeah, we'll, have, we'll be having a couple of frame skips here and there. As well as a couple of audio, um cuts and stuff. I don't know why. Dazzle being stupid. That's all that's all I have to say. But yeah. Enjoy the speed. The speed. Oh, and for those that didn't get um the the penny reference that I said before, go watch um Brain Scratch Com's Sonic Adventure let's play. Even to this day Tails still, uh, uh, Sonic still owes tail that pe tails that penny. Ah, uh, skydiving. Well, to be honest, this isn't this isn't very interesting. Oh, uh, okay, that is probably the one bit in the game that I will say controls quite. Uh, the controls are quite annoying. And wow, just wow. <laughs> oh, I love this level. But I kind of failed at it, I'm not going to lie. I mean, I, I... I... I technically... Well, I didn't fail as much as much as I... Um, actually, no, I didn't fail. What am I talking about? Um, I did pretty well in this run. I could have done better. But I, I pretty much could always have done better. But uh, this was a pretty good run. This was a pretty good run. Um, I'm pretty satisfied with it. And hopefully, you will be too. Yeah, but um, I'm not really here to show off my mad ultra elite zone skills from Planet Mars. No, I'm just here to entertain. And if you if you guys are entertained by this let's play, then I have done my job. I have I I have been successful, and the cake is not a lie. I like cake. Which brings me on to the question of the day. Which do you prefer? Pie or cake? Land on that rail, by the way. It's quite hard. To, um, you have to um, time an air boost properly. Question of the day. Do you prefer pie or cake? And with the question of the day, we also conclude the video. That is all we have time for this time. We whipped out our S rank. Hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in part two.